city within the last couple of decades. The capital, the Emirate of Dubai and the United Arab Emirates. The city is known for its upscale shopping, thriving nightlife, and lovely skyscrapers. One of these, the Hotel Burj Al Arab is the fourth tallest hotel in the world and sits on an artificial island off Dubai's coast. Its priciest suite, the Royal Suite, is a wonder to behold. Perched on the 25th floor overlooking the Gulf and only accessible by private elevator. The least of its impressive features is its absolutely staggering size, 8,400 square feet, with a marble stairway, a massive entryway, and massive pillars, all covered with 14 carry gold. The suite is divided into areas for men and women, and also features a huge dining area. bathrooms are a main feature. Their fixtures are made from Italian marble imported from Verona, and one bathroom features a full jacuzzi and a steam room. While the redesign has given the space a more modern feel, the antique furniture is from the era of Louis XV and ties in with the decor for a distinctly classical vibe. The appropriately named Royal Suite is indeed fit for a king, and it will help to be one if you hope to afford the going rate of about $26,000 per night. When it comes to major historical cities, very few tie visitors to the ancient past like the majestic Italian capital of Rome. The city's history spans well over 2,000 years, and it is seen as the birthplace of Western civilization, producing many of the first great achievements in art, science, education, and culture. Today, it is the 14th most visited city in Europe, with millions of tourists every year coming to see its museums and ancient monuments. Rome's Westin Excelsior Hotel has been called one of the most luxurious hotels in the entire world. While some of its rooms come within shouting distance of affordability, its luxury suite, called the Villa La Cupola, comes with a head spinning price tag. It features an unbelievable five floors of five-star luxury, totaling 6,100 square feet. And if that seems excessive, keep in mind that it doesn't include the balconies and terraces, which tack on another 1,800 square feet. The suite has its own private elevator leading to a fitness area, along with a private theater and a total of seven bedrooms. Marble, Italian walnut, and hand-painted frescoes are among the elaborate and expensive decor. Antique chandeliers, a private cupola, your own wine cellar, the luxurious appointments are almost too numerous to list. Of course, you can simply book a night or two and check it out for yourself when in Rome, if you don't mind the $30,000 per night rate. Of course, if you're looking for over-the-top luxury without having to dig out your passport, look no further than the American capital of decadence. Las Vegas is billed as the entertainment capital of the world, and it never stops trying day or night to live up to that billing. 
The internationally renowned resort city and its famous strip are one of the hottest tourist destinations on the planet, and Vegas has long been a leader in the luxury hospitality industry. As such, its most expensive hotel suite is simply jaw-dropping in its extravagance. The Sky Villa Suite at the Palms Casino Resort is located 30 stories above the Strip, a 9,000-square-foot palace in the sky with private butlers attending to the needs of you and your guests. Along with all of the expected luxurious amenities, the suite features a glass elevator to the master bedroom, which has a spectacular 360-degree panoramic view of the city, a private gym and massage room, and the ultimate showstopper, the pool. The private heated pool is located on a two-story terrace overlooking the city that transforms into a private nightclub, complete with neon lights and surround sound stereo system. It's little wonder that a parade of rock stars and celebrities have stayed here, and it's only $35,000 per night. It may come as no surprise that France is one of only two countries on our list to make a repeat appearance. The city of Cannes on the French Riviera is of course world famous for its international film festival. Perhaps the most influential film festival in the world and an important showcase for international cinema. The city is also known for its ultra upscale aesthetic and as a playground for the rich and famous, and is home to a number of luxury hotels and resorts. The Hotel Martinez, acquired by Hyatt in 2012, was opened in 1929 and quickly became one of the most respected luxury hotels in France. Its penthouse suite is 3,200 square feet of luxury, located on its seventh floor, with an astonishing view of the Bay of Cannes from its private terrace, which, believe it or not, is almost as large as the suite itself at a mind-blowing 2,900 square feet. The incredibly spacious bathrooms are outfitted in marble, a suite-wide Bose sound system caters to your every music need, and a butler caters to any other need you might have. Luxury like this in a city known for its love affair with all things ritzy is bound to come at a steep price, $37,500 per night. The Raj Palace was once the oldest and one of the largest mansions in India, and in 1996 it was converted into a stunning luxury hotel. In this hotel, every suite is grand luxury. Each one has its own private mini-museum, and they're decorated in priceless antique furniture. The hotel's dining room is even home to the world's largest chandelier. But the crown jewel of the Raj Palace is the most expensive hotel suite in all of Asia, the Presidential Suite, also known as Maharaja's Pavilion. The four-story suite connected by a private elevator boasts an unbelievable 16,000 square feet of space. The first floor contains the private lounge and bar. The second houses the private museum, with walls intricately decorated with gold leaf and mirror work, and also overlooks the courtyards and gardens. The third floor has a lavish dining area adorned with priceless decorations, and the fourth has a private rooftop terrace with amazing city views, private spa, and entrance for your private butler staff. Bathrooms have solid gold and silver fixtures. Antique furniture is crafted from silver, gold, and ivory. Every detail of this opulent suite screams luxury. And well, it should. To live like the Maharaja for just one night, it'll cost you $45,000. The only other American entry on our list is located, of course, in the Big Apple. Requiring no introduction, New York City is simply the cultural and financial capital of the world, the global leader in commerce, technology, fashion, and more, and home to its fair share of world-renowned luxury hotels. Opened in 1993, the Four Seasons New York is a five-star hotel with a sterling reputation for service and luxury. Even the least expensive of its guest rooms will set you back $1,200, and its Ty Warner penthouse located on the 52nd floor is at this time the most expensive hotel suite in the United States. Named after the hotel's owner, the 4,300-square-foot suite was a collaboration between designer Peter Marino and famed architect I.M. Pei, who came out of retirement to work on the project. Adorned in 22-karat gold and featuring sweeping 25-foot cathedral ceilings, the suite's amenities are positively insane. In addition to the personal butler, personal trainer, and private chauffeur, it features unlimited global calling and TVs that can receive literally any channel in the world. The suite's decor is absolutely impeccable. Walls inlaid with mother of pearl, gilded bronze chandeliers, and four French doors that open on the most perfect view of Central Park in the city. You won't find a more luxurious or expensive stay anywhere in the US, a cool $50,000 per night. 
If there is one major city that can overwhelm visitors with its connection to history even more than Rome, it is Athens, Greece. Its site has been inhabited for thousands of years, with its recorded history alone going back 3,400 years, and it remains an important international trade hub. The Grand Resort Laganissi is a beachfront five-star hotel with an international reputation for pampering its guests. With only 18 suites, the level of comfort ranges from luxurious to mind-bogglingly ultra-luxurious. Embodied in the second most expensive hotel suite in the world, the Royal Villa, the 4,400-square-foot suite boasts all of the perks and then some. Marble bathrooms, private massage area, butler service, private parking, heated floors, and a grand piano, complete with pianist. As if that weren't enough, there are two heated private pools, one indoor and one outdoor, and a beautiful 7,000-square-foot private garden. This beachfront suite has practically everything the insanely wealthy could ever want, and all it'll cost is $50,000 per night. Finally, the Royal Penthouse Suite at the Hotel President Wilson in Geneva, Switzerland has recently been recognized as the largest and most expensive hotel suite in the world. Located on the 8th and top floor of the hotel, the stunning 18,000 square foot suite is rumored to have hosted such international celebrities as Bill Clinton, Michael Jackson, and Bill Gates. The suite takes up an entire floor and features an incredible view of Lake Geneva. With multiple master bedrooms and living rooms and a dining room that can seat 26, the suite has more than enough room to entertain famous guests. It also has its own private boardroom, a 1,700-square-foot terrace with a telescope, a private media center and billiards room, and one of the few existing 103-inch Bong & Olufsen flat-screen televisions. With hand-picked original art, the highest-end appliances available, and only the most upscale furnishings and decor, the suite also keeps the needs of its rich and famous occupants in mind with an emphasis on security. Aside from the bulletproof windows, motion detection system, and armored doors, the hotel even throws in your own private security team during your stay. All of this adds up to the most extravagant of all hospitality experiences. The Royal Penthouse Suite is the ultimate in luxury hotel rooms, and the priciest of them all, at $80,000 per night.